Hello everybody, welcome to BrewBots. In this video here, I will go over uh, beta strings and a new update to it. If you notice, if you go into beta strings now, there's no longer a, a Cody guide. Yes, they're taking the Cody guide out and now I just got a regular TV guide now. So, this is what the regular TV guide looks like. Right here. This TV guide right here is connected to beta. So, you click on it. It'll take a little bit for it to load up. When it does, and there, there you have it. Now, um, these are here at the top. This right here is the actual list I'm looking at, the all channels. You can change this. You go to sports, change there. You go to Canada, change Canada, premium movies, United Kingdom, United States. Now you can change all of this at the top right here. If you don't want any of this up here, you can just change that. You'll simply um, backing out of the add-on itself and then going back into beta. Now when you go to beta, all you need to do is go down to settings. Once you get into settings, go to EP, EPG groups, then go to configure EPG groups. And you wait a little bit. All right, now it comes up here. And this is right here, all the groups that I have selected. Now, after you select these groups, then you have to restart. That's your um, restart Cody period. So after you restart Cody, then it will come up with the actual, what you have selected. So what's up there now is what comes up there, um, what's the default. Uh, so we're going to have Canada, UK, United States. That's all default right there. But you can change that. You can also put any of these countries up there you have. And you can also put live events up there as well. But uh, depends on how much, how big and bloated you want this list to be. But it's pretty simple to even do. So if, say if I select something here, I'm going to put live events up there. And then I'm going to hit close. It's going to tell you right there, you need to restart it. You hit OK. And you see now I have 470 channels loaded, but in order for that to load up on your guide, you need to restart it. So it's going to ask to restart it. So I'm going to click yes this time. Now, once you do this, what it's doing is actually shutting down your Cody. So once it's, this, way, this right here could take a little bit, could take up to about two minutes or so. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to get all of that. Want to shut my Cody down manually? Yeah, it's already shut down, so I'm just going to hit open now. Now I'm back on my main menu. Now, what you need to do. With the old um, version, what you had to do is wait until your actual TV got loaded up. So let's see, can I speed up that process? And go straight to the TV guide. And as you can see, my TV guide is now loaded up with the correct with the correct subcategories. Now, as you can see, on my TV guide, there's nothing up there. That's because it, it, it hasn't loaded up yet. So what I was supposed to do is wait till it load up. And you see at the top, it said now it's loading. Well, I got to clear my, my cache and all that first, but at the top, it should start loading. This right here is what I'm talking about right here. This is the loading. This is, you have to import your TV guide first. Once this is done, this should fill up everything in your guide. 
So what you want to do, you want to wait until this is done first before you go into the guide or before you even go into beta. So just sit patiently and wait. And it could take a little bit. Don't worry about it. As long as you got internet, it will load. So now I can click, click my categories. Sports. It's my live event section. Let's go to premium movies. There's my premium movie section. It's my United States section. And you know the United States section is uh basic cable networks and then here's my United States regional section like I said before you can put whatever you want in there just make sure you restart it so it, in order for those changes to take place and then with this it works the same way as it as it did before you can just pretty much click on something I say just click on here Now you can change the channel, pressing up or down. Another thing you can do is actually um, press the numbers. Now when you press the numbers to change the channel, it got to be three digits. So if you want to go to channel 22, it needs to be 0, 22, which is posted in the top left hand corner. And there you go. You change the channel. That's the way that works. So here's what we're going to do now. I will show you how to get to the guy. As you can see, I had my guy save the favorites, but uh, you may not have your saved as favorites. So what you need to do for that is just simply um, go to programs. Now, I know you're looking at the build I got and you're saying, oh, I don't have the same build. It doesn't matter what build you got. Just look for the same stuff. All right. So um, this one. I don't have programs listed on the actual main menu. So you can see, it doesn't have programs, it doesn't have add-on listed on the menu. So what I'm gonna do now, is simply click, if you do have it on your main menu, just click the words program and then you'll get to it. You click programs and you go to TV Guide. Since I don't have it up there, what I have to do is go to add-ons, system first, then add-ons, then my add-ons, and then I'm going to go to program add-ons. And from there, TV guy. There it is like that. Again. I'll show you how to do it again. Now, if I said before, it doesn't matter what build you have. Some, some of you may have programs listed up here. Some don't. So what you can simply do. I'm going to wait for the TV guy to get finished loading up. All right. 
Click on the word system, then the word add-ons. Then my add-ons. Then program add-ons. Then TV Guide. It's in alphabetical order, so you can't miss it. And this is the one you need to click on. This exact one. So if you have any questions, please contact me. Let me know, and I'll help you out.